And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And we've got what we hope will be exciting league action coming up for you. Stuart, what are you expecting to see? Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, although we have it down as a 4-5-1, it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10 and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, they're starting in a very solid 4-5-1, but they transition really quickly, and key to that are the wide players. They'll support the centre forward as soon as they win the ball back, and they usually do it with a lot of quality. And the match begins. Saint Louis. Chifchi. Gradel has it. Yatabare. Good looking sequence. Size. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Well, it doesn't make great reading for our hosts. Just look at this. It's the weakest attack in the league, and that's official. Well, I'm not surprised by their lack of goals. Their approach play is far too predictable. It lacks invention and goal, which makes it almost impossible for the forwards to find space. And I can't see that changing today. Now, what can they do from here? Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Yilmaz. And he might be through here. Well, the goalkeeper in charge of the situation. He's driven in the corner. No nonsense clearance. Sais. No close down straight away. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, a powerful effort, but just wide. Dillon Saint Louis. It's with Zay Luis. Dudziak. In position. How can they prize them open now? And giving it away. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. 
Frederik Ulverstad. Samu Saiz. Real chance. Oh, that was begging to be put home, but the goalkeeper has it. Zé Luis. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Well, as you can see, it's been really tight, and neither side has taken enough risk going forward. Hopefully that will change soon, and then we might get some entertainment. Yes, a stalemate so far. Will that situation change? He's using his body to good effect. Read it superbly to take back possession. Gradel. Yatabari. Samu Saiz. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Could be really classy goalkeeping, but hang on. Offside is the decision here. Now, who can he play it to? Oh, he's given it away and clears his lines. So nothing to choose between the teams at half-time as the referee blows his whistle. Stuart, your impressions of our hosts? Well, the hardest thing as a coach is to get both sides of the game right. Today's a great example. They've looked solid defensively, but once again, they haven't posed enough of a threat going forward. It'll be interesting to see how they approach the second half. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Oh, a vital interception. Can he find the net? Well kept out. And time for the change now. Who can he pick out? High class defending right on the goal line. Just the clearance that was needed. And a throw-in it's going to be. Who can he pick out? Making progress. But they took care of the situation defensively. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Can they take advantage of the situation? Might take the lead. He knew he had to make the tackle and did. And the substitution will occur now. He's driven in the corner. Still not clear. Size. And space to cross it. Samu Saiz. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Promising sequence. 
Superbly read and executed. James. And a tidy ball. Ulverstad. Really vital interception. And the counter looks on here. Options available. It's there for him. And now it's there for him. And a goal it is. The keeper really not part of the equation. Well, as you can see, the defending is really poor, but he won't mind. It's a simple finish for him. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Kofi. Gradel has it. Well, possibilities in the centre. Not really the ideal clearance. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes, and now both sides will make personnel switches. Trying to pick out a teammate. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. Delivering it. Now it still could be dangerous. Moving forward effectively. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Ribeiro. It's with Zé Luis. Ruben Ribeiro. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. An alert piece of defending. Gradel. It's with Samu Saiz. And into an attacking position. It's not too late for them. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Beautifully weighted ball. Could be dangerous. This could finish it. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. And there it is, the final whistle. And the fans will be leaving the stadium with smiles on their faces. Well, we talked about their struggles in front of goal, but today they were excellent going forward. There was a real zip about their passing, and the movement of the ball was just as good. That was so much better.